Today for Mousetrap Monday, we're going to take a break from catching mice and rats and test out another yellow jacket trap. A few weeks ago, I posted a video on how to catch yellow jackets, and that video has received a lot of interest, over a million and a half views in just a few weeks. This time of year, yellow jackets are so aggressive. So in this video, we're going to test out a yellow jacket trap called the Fatal Funnel. Inside are six traps, so let's take them out of the box and see what they look like. Here's the Fatal Funnel traps. They're made out of plastic. They almost look like a flower. They have an entryway here that's a funnel. They have some teeth on the sides, little knob right there. The plastic is shaped in a way that it curves. That way it fits on the side of a two liter bottle. You poke a hole in the bottle, put these in with the jaws. The idea is the yellow jackets will go inside, get in the bottle, and they can't get out with the funnel. So let's go mix up the bait and put it in the bottle, attach the traps, and see if we can get some yellow jackets. There, both of those fit nicely. For bait, the recommendation was to add sugar water, apple juice, kind of looks like a urine sample in there, and some meat. Here I'm using fish. It's nice and smelly, should bring them in. We already have a visitor here. Finally, I'm gonna add the fish to the front I'm going to stick it on the prong, but first I'm going to rub it all around the entrance. Get that nice and smelly. This yellow jacket wants that sugar water and apple juice. These yellow jackets are after this fish. They're really aggressive. That should be very enticing. Let's go hang the trap before I get stung. They just keep going in there. Within a few minutes, we already caught a bunch of yellow jackets. I'm gonna leave this for a few hours and see how many we get. It's been five hours and it looks like the catch rate has really slowed down. They ate all the meat off the front of the funnel and when they did, the swarm moved on. It looks like we're just getting a few singles here or there. I consider these kinds of traps to be more maintenance to get the scouts. In my opinion, there's no better yellow jacket trap than the homemade one I featured a few weeks ago where you put some meat on a board and watch them drop in some soapy water. You can quickly catch over a thousand yellow jackets in just a few hours and it doesn't really cost anything to make. These other yellow jacket traps do work, you just don't catch as many. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please consider giving the button right there a little flip. I'm posting between four and five trap videos a week, so if you want to see how to catch mice, rats, squirrels, chipmunks, moles, voles, and gophers, and occasionally yellow jackets, stay tuned.